So a couple weeks ago, Bungie dropped the brand new Ghosts of the Deep dungeon. As is tradition on this channel, I'm gonna give it my best solo attempt. I've heard this dungeon is currently the hardest to solo of the bunch, which both makes me excited and terrified. So put on your best photo finish Taken King armor, and I'll show you exactly how not to solo Ghosts of the Deep. Simon. You got a pen. I don't know how this is gonna go. This is a very difficult dungeon. It's not even difficult, it's an endurance test. The only weapon I've got from this is the rocket launcher. I think I've gotten it four or five times. Because the first boss is very up close and personal, and he likes to get all up in our shit, I have Legend of Acrius here. I've literally never gotten to use this thing. I oh wait, pet the dog. Oh shit, wait. All right, let's do it. All right, boys. It's been a minute since we tried to solo a dungeon, and it did not go well last time. <laughs> I'm gonna swap onto Strand just for fun. Catalysts are really cool and all, but I, I think that for the majority of them, they kind of drag on. So, you know, you have to like go around and just kill like so many enemies that it becomes monotonous. And by the time you're done with the Catalyst, you don't actually like the weapon anymore. Anyway, so the opening encounter isn't that hard, but it establishes a pretty annoying trend for the rest of the dungeon. That being that every zone is a respawn restricted zone. On top of that, these encounters tend to drag on quite a lot, especially solo. So dying and having to restart the whole thing just feels really bad. Also, y'all are gonna have to get used to my whack-ass call-outs for the symbols. Oh, wait, 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 hold up. God damn it. Oh, shit, it's a respawn restricted zone? Oh, oh, right, it's the... There we go, there we go. Are you fucking... Okay, let's put on serious mode. There we go. And I don't know if Hammer Titan's ever not gonna be good. Perfect. There we go. Um, oh, come on. Come on. Come on. How much health does the first boss have? Does anyone know? <laughs> Synthesis. There it is. Sweet. Now I just have to do that four more times. Sounds easy enough, and to be fair, it is. But as with all things in this dungeon, it's not about how hard it is, it's about how long you can take it. Man, this place reminds me, there's like a Halo Reach map. A big team battle Halo Reach map. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Oh shit, come back, no! There's no way I'm getting that one back. Okay, he's supercharged, let's not, so let's just go for it. Ooh! Okay, okay, okay. Oh my god. Okay, um, we're looking for star. What the, why? Did I run out of time on the imbued with light? Get that. Wait, 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 wait. All right, now we're looking for Top Hat. Where's Top Hat? There's Top Hat. Star Bex. There we go. All right, that is for Scarab. Almost done. Let's look for Scarab. Sweet. One more way through, like, everything, right? And, you know, Warlocks, you guys are good enough with Restoration. Oh, yeah. Oh, let's go. Let's get out of here. That one shot you? Nope. There we go. Okay, Vex, where is it? Where is it? Oh, it's right there. Let's go. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Please, just not a rocket launcher, man. Okay, we're going deeper. With the first encounter out of the way, it's time for this long-ass bridge section. And I do mean long. It took me about 25 minutes to reach the first boss. Now, part of that was because halfway through this underwater section, I freaking died. Oh, shit. No way, bro. Oh, you're kidding. You're kidding. That's... I just got catfished. What the hell? And since this is a respawn restricted zone, I had to do the whole water section again. For the fear of, like, large objects submerged underwater. I think it's called submechanophobia. Thalassophobia? Okay. If you have thalassophobia, don't do this dungeon. Eventually, I made it out of the water and cut through these acolytes with triple shotguns. Though it wasn't long before I found myself back in the water. Some more hive and a couple failed jumps later, and wouldn't you know it, we're at the first boss of the dungeon. First boss time, swap back on to our solar getup. You think I'm gonna die 12 times? That's a solid prediction. All right, so for this boss, it's advised that you use double specials, tractor cannon, and a bonk hammer if you're a titan. And of course, don't forget Syntheseps. But if you know me and you've been around the channel for any amount of time, then you know we like to do things a bit differently, really shake up the meta every once in a while. So instead of the usual titan hammer with double specials, Syntheseps, and tractor cannon, I'm gonna be rocking titan hammer, double specials, Syntheseps, and Legend of Acrius. Now, I know some of you right now are breaking out 
out into a cold sweat at the thought of me fracturing the meta to such a degree. But don't worry, because it didn't work. So like I said, I'm gonna try with Acrius first. Friendly UAV Man, I didn't mean to just interrupt their prayer. Alright, what symbols are we looking for? Um, Scarab? Uh, Scarab, what is Top Hat and Table? We got Scarab, we got one Veto, uh, that's not what we're looking for. I think that's actually what we're looking for. I may have already forgotten the symbols. Okay, this was one of them. Come on, Oh my god! Come on, get out of here. Get out of here, go. Yeah, one down. Crazy. What the f it's like the table with some utensils on top. I don't think I have a name for that one. We'll, just, we'll call it Utensil. Yeah, there it is. That's Utensil. Come on, come on. We can do it. We can do it. We can do it. I got a good giggle when I watched it for the first time. What the why? Oh, I didn't... I'm, I'm so stupid. Oh, come on. Come here. Okay, that could have been done better. Damn it, man. We should have waited to do the Avatar video. Yeah. Oh, sh come on. You didn't need to do that to me right there. These guys are on that mega AI tonight. Oh my god, Ekthar, hop off my dick, man. Oh my god, Ekthar, but there's Vex. There's Table. Alright, come on, get that shield down. Oh, come on, come on, we can, we can, we can, we can, we can, we can- How was that damage? Was that okay? I have, I really wanted Legend of Acrius to work. Maybe if we buy the- Oh, I have the ornament for it. This is the pay-to-win ornament. Oh, fuck. Come on. Okay, okay. Not gonna lie, I was expecting a bit more from the pay to win ornament. It's like right here. Oh shit. Come on. Come on, we can make this. No way, man. Ugh. The ornament wasn't pay to win. Okay, let's switch to tractor. I'm sorry. This ornament is pay to win. I want to see how big of a difference tractor makes. Because right now we're not operating on any debuffs. I didn't rally, did I? Oh my god! Okay. Oh, there have you here. Alright, well... Oh my god. Oh, that's a lot better. That is so much better! That's still like a 6 phase, but it's a more comfortable 6 phase. What do you mean I threw a grenade? 5.1 milli though, god damn. There. When am I gonna stop doing that, man? Oh, where's where? I'll take what I can get. So you secretly shot with all these missed throws. <laughs> oh, that was disrespectful. Hurt my feelings. Shaq, a big strong man outside. But soft inside. Everyone is calling Shaq dumb. But Shaq not dumb. There we go. And three. Hurt my feelings. Oh, so close to half. Found no fall. If I ever fall, I'm gonna take the fall. There we go. No fucking way! I was just about to throw. God. Oh. Oh, uh, can I have that back, please? I'm not getting that back. Person utensil star. Remember the last one. I. What the why? Did I kill a, a hive wizard there? My mods a little bit to further optimize damage. I missed my hammer. I need that back. Leave, leave me alone. Leave me alone. No shot. Ooh. Yeah, I'm gonna get out of here now, just because I don't want to- I think that was our best single phase damage. Um, circle, utensil, person. Uten what the- Really? I thought it was- I thought that was it. So I realized this in a bit, but what happened there was that I kept forgetting that these two are different symbols. This is also what got me killed a few attempts ago. Okay, well now I'm- now I'm just being- Shite. Okay, that's like table with a person on it, utensil, but not utensil. Utensil with legs. Yeah, yeah, that one. I think that's where I've messed up. Oh my god, what the shit? Okay. No fing way. God damn. I feel like I just kind of have to throw myself at this encounter until we get it. Where, where hammer, where hammer, where hammer, where hammer, and why not here? There hammer. Everywhere. Okay, we're doing 128 per melee right now. Alright, good damage. Oh, you asshole! You asshole! Whatever. Oh, you fuck! You suppressed me! We've been at this for a while and not once has he done that. Yeah, that sucked. 
I gave it another attempt and died to an unfortunately timed pressure failure. Oh, you suck. You really suck. I, I can't make that. I'm not going to risk it. Come on, let me out, please. No way! I hate this so much. I then tried again and died on my way to damage. Oh my god. Uh, I'm going to go get my soda that I have downstairs. Are you guys ready for this? Tasty. So we decided it was about time to give Lament a shot, but full warning, I am not good with Lament, like at all. Oh, right, so can we do this until that's charged up? Sorry, I'm like, I'm a Lament noob. Oh, shit. Okay, get me out of here. Get... Okay, okay. Oh my god, I hate Lament so much. I'm so bad with it. Oh my god, the, the, like the terrain, I'm telling you, a lot of Lament users out there. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme! Oh, good one, Toad. Good one. Oh, f*** you. Oh my god. Okay, we're switching back to Tractor. While it may seem odd to get that close and then switch to something else, my damage with Tractor was just way better. And quite frankly, I was tired of this boss. Oh, I'm a- I'm a chicken nugget, man. Oh. Get the f*** out of here! God, table, person, utensil, with legs. Okay, fine. I'm not complaining. Fuck you, Vector. Hurt my feelings. Vector. Vector, let's go. Yes. Yes. Oh shit. Oh my god. Oh, I need a sip of Sprite. Oh, I'm not a total donut. If this gives me a rocket launcher, I'm leaving. Let's go. Look at the Tokun. This bridge section was a bit shorter, but still kind of long because, well, I suck. There we go, there we go, there we go. Shit, this is today, but I, I couldn't get a. Oh! I couldn't get a. Goddamn moth. Oh, for. F this is truly one of the dungeons of all time. Wow. I am so bad at this game. There was, is there like a rally here or something? This is really annoying. There we go, yeah, that's, that's better. What am I gonna do about you? Oh, what was that little ammo influx? I think we can just run from here. Let me smash. There we go. We'll get this chest to get another rocket launcher. Oh, playtime's over. We have to actually start using our brain. Who is that? I went ahead and ditched Lament and Acrius since, well, they aren't going to be much of a help here. One of our live viewers then recommended that I try Leviathan's Breath, although upon realizing that I didn't actually have the catalyst, we sent it back to the Lord. So we just thinking Arbalest Taipan then? I threw on Arc Resist for the added protection and went in with Arbalest and Taipan, which is a setup that I don't think I really need to explain. Like Deep Sight, and then we have to do a ritual, we have to kill the, the dude, what was his name called? Like, for God, it was like Nazi or something like that. <clears throat> what are you going to do about it, bitch? So nice. Oh, wow. wow, 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 wow. Give me deep sight. Let's do his knee first. Where are you? Where are you? Come on. Where are Hello? you? Did you forget who I am? Oh, that was a huge hammer. All right, I'm gonna die. Huge Simuma Urnakru damage. I tried using this pulse rifle, but it just wasn't cutting it, so I swapped onto the Root of Nightmares Trace instead. This encounter is long even with three people. Solo is a whole other animal. The mechanic rotation alone is pretty long, but on top of that, this wizard also has quite a lot of health. Oh shit, what symbol is this? You uh, want utensil with legs? There we go. That's what we like to hear. I cut through the remaining Hive Guardians and went to start our first damage phase. Oh my god, I forgot. There are still adds here. Holy shit. In my first damage phase, I hit her with a whopping- <laughs> Yeah, this is gonna be a long fight. I went into the water to kill this wizard, and upon returning, I got mothed really hard. Oh my god. I can't see what is happening. Oh, no way! Um, yeah, let me put double arc resist on. I went back in and was immediately smitten by Vorlog. In my next run, I realized that you can't actually do the chest ritual first in the sequence. It has to come after another ritual. I then died to an acolyte. I also put on Loralee and updated my drip to match. This is actively draining my soul. On my next attempt, I didn't even get to a damage phase. It doesn't help that Vorlog's AI has, like, is cranked to the max. That boy be ducking and swerving my shots like no tomorrow. I then died to the moths trying to kill Vorlog. 
That's crazy! <laughs> at this point, I was just throwing myself at the encounter, hoping that I'd get lucky, which isn't really what you want to do in this situation. I then proceeded to die twice in five minutes and get absolutely bamboozled by Vorlog. Ooh! Hello. You got bamboozled. Come on, Vorlog, you're killing me, man. Where is he? What do you mean? I finally realized this wasn't working and swapped over to Risk Runner to survive the first section, something that proved to be a really good change. After every rotation, I swapped Risk Runner out for Arbalest, the reason being that Arbalest can one-shot the wizard's shield. There you are. The first damage phase was fine, I guess. I can't really hope for much more here. But I did realize that we could kill the Hive Boomers and they'd stay dead for a whole rotation. There we go. There we go. There's a the superconductor. There we go. We'll do Hunter first. Let's switch back on to Arby. Um, we go here. And we go here. Okay. Oh, utensil with legs. Stay with show. Okay. Come on, come on, let me hit you, goddammit. This ain't it, dude. So much. I hate you so much. Got it. Calm down. Kill Joy. Oh wow, yeah, that dropped it. Alright, not bad. Rock here, take those. Okay, we're chill with that. Oh, our conductor is so good. You gonna let me do this to you? No. Don't let me do this to you. Oh, uh, person. Dude, I feel like even getting her down to half health is an achievement. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. There we go. Okay, that was close. Okay. There we go. Okay. Okay, this is utensil with legs. Another one. And another one. Oh, and another one. That shit was personal. Okay. We knew it was gonna happen. I, the moment I like looked down and didn't see a healing nade, I'm upset. But at the same time, that was such a good run. But I'm proud that we made it that far. How long was that? That one attempt was almost exactly an hour long. When you're playing for that long, chances are pretty high you'll choke at some point. I didn't have it in me to run it again solo, so I brought Duck in to help me clear it for a chance at the exotic. Percent confident that that is yours? Oh no, yours is person. Uh, it's a ball, get it right. In what planet is that a ball? What? It looks I'm like a person! Ball. This is- I'm not about to do this. Ball. Chat. <laughs> what do you mean, chat? <laughs> to me, that screams like basketball. Yes. Take, like, GG. GG. <laughs> I may not have soloed it, but I really am happy with my attempt. I do think the boss's health bars will be nerfed a little bit at some point, but I'm glad I gave it an attempt beforehand. But either way, if you made it to the end, I really appreciate that. And if you want to see more content just like this every week, consider subscribing and helping me on my way to that coveted 100k mark. Also, I know I'm a bit late, but a huge shout out to all the latest channel members, and there's a lot of them. Unholy Pepe, Cade's Horn, Mightiest Mango, Dr. Direwolf, Dango Dot, Puffin's Muffin. Nova Pufferfish, Legend, Valen, Colin Gilmore, Hell Garmer, Big Hat Benny, Houston, Rorick, Matthew Damorum, Monter, Zephyr Type, J Red423, Dotting Zeus 0254, Lucas, Totally Not Tardis, BF 1046, Ryan Wolf, Valton Zanola, Spark Spark Boom, My, my Mate James, Amazing Scout, Aiden O'Neill, Richard Osgood, Fenris Wolf, Astol, Shovel Monarch, Justin Pagano, and Trash Panda. I truly appreciate all your support, and I'm sorry that was a bit late. Alright, I'm gonna wrap things up. I hope you're having a great day, night, or whatever it is, and until next time, Guardians, goodbye.